Judine, you're paying for convenience. You don't have to walk out the block in the hot sun and sweat. You know you don't like sweating. Somebody else is gonna gracefully sit in the store and pick the items out. It's the least you can do to make sure that somebody else is paid. Okay, great, I'm convinced. Today is Wednesday and I'm obviously ready for work. I'm just waiting for like maybe five minutes to go and wake my husband up. This morning I woke up and I was trying to check my account because I got like a notification and I was not able to log in and I've been trying since and I just have not been able to log in. Anyways, I'm not even thinking about that right now. Like, later on when I come home, I'll have to figure that out. I ate some breakfast, but I don't think I slept well last night. So I feel a little crazy right now. Like, right now, I feel like if I lay down, I could probably sleep. And I don't like that. I don't like that at all. I'm so annoyed. But, whatever. I have candy in my pocket just in case I need a little pick-me-up on the energy. I could, like, eat those. And they'll give me a sugar rush so I can... I'm sitting here deliberating between if I want to take my lunch bag with lunch or if I want to just take some snacks because I don't know um, what floor I'm going to be on or if I'm going to get early lunch or late lunch. So I'm really leaning more towards just taking some snacks and like my water bottle. Yeah, I think I'll do that. So. I'm going to have to put the food back in the fridge. I'm wearing a different sneakers today because I think I showed you guys on the last vlog that the one that I was wearing last week, I had it for about eight months and because the top of it was like a thinner material, like a stretchy one, almost like a sock, but like thicker. It, like the part on my right foot where like my big toe was always touching like that part was looking like it was getting a hole. So I'm like, no, we're not doing this. So I threw it away and of course I had another one that I could wear. So that's what's up. And like I said, I'm ready to go. I really hope that today is a smooth day. Honestly, because who doesn't love a smooth day? Especially because I'm PMSing right now. Like I feel like I'm already low on energy from PMSing. And then putting it out there in the universe that today's going to be a good day. And I'm off tomorrow. So I kind of like that. Hopefully by the time I should go back the day after, like, I'm done PMSing because I need it to go, honestly. But yeah, see, I feel a little bit tired right now and I don't like that. Today I have to go to the, um, to the staffing coordinator because she said I need to do, like, fingerprint or whatever. So she needs to get that set up. So I'm gonna have to go to her this morning when I get there. And hopefully that doesn't like completely delay my day because I find that, you know, once you go there, you just want to get your assignment and like get going. And since I'm a temp right now, like I'm not permanent, in the mornings I have to wait for the day shift nurse to come, which is around 7 o'clock, you know, to get my assignment so that I can get started even though I get there from a little bit earlier. So that in itself is also something, you know, just the fact that you have to wait for somebody else to come to really give you an assignment. It's a little bit out there. But, um, yeah. Oh, 6.25. I'm about to go wait my husband up. So he can drop me to work. So I'll see you guys later on. Hi, guys. It's the next day from the last clip that you guys just watched. And today I'm off. This, this morning I went on the road and I ran some errands. And, you know, now I'm back home. And I just feel like... I should have went straight to the grocery store this morning because now I'm very annoyed. Like, I'm thinking about ordering some groceries on Instacart. And I'm very conflicted because everything came... Like, when I go to, like, the checkout, it's saying $170-something. However, I know that if I go to the grocery store, I might either spend less or I might get more that still comes out to less. Because I feel like with Instacart, right, I get that I'm paying for the convenience and all of that. But I just feel like um, 
I don't know. It's saying 152, right? A one, which is the price for everything. And then after all that, right, with the tip that you're gonna have to pay the person, the delivery fee that you're gonna have to pay, and the service fee that you're gonna have to pay, it is saying that altogether it's gonna be $173. That's ten dollars more. That's twenty dollars more. What am I saying? That is a whole $20 more. And if I went to the grocery store and I picked up $152 worth of stuff, it would be $152 because they delivered for free after, I think, $50. And then the guy, he would, I normally tip him because I really like him and he brings the groceries like all the way up the stairs and everything. And so I feel like I still wouldn't pay that extra $20. I hate feeling like I'm paying for things that I won't use. I don't like that. Pick up one ninety nine. I don't want to go pick it up either, cause somebody's gonna have to put it together. That's how far that store is. What the fuck? Oh wait, but if I did that, no. Mm mm. I don't know. So I just feel like, girl, just go to the grocery store. You're gonna get fresh chicken anyways that you're sure about, and stuff like that. So I just said it's two forty three right now, and I set a reminder for three thirty to. Go actually buy the goddamn groceries myself because I just feel like, oh, what am I paying for? Crap. So I'm wondering if I want to just bite the bullet and be like, all right, let me stay home and save an hour or an hour and a half and wait for it to get here. But it's not like I'm doing anything where I need. I'm literally just sitting now watching YouTube videos. So it's just like, it's not even that serious. Like, just go to the goddamn grocery store. And I could just wait until the day after tomorrow because I work tomorrow. So if I waited until the day after tomorrow, then... My husband would be home and I wouldn't have to tip anybody or pay the delivery fee. But when he's in the store, it ends up costing me more. Because he takes up all these random little bits and bobs. And I'm just like, right, stop touching stuff. <laughs> Damn. <laughs> so I really don't know what I want to do. I don't know. I mean, it's not like the place is completely empty right now. Because we have food. I have food that I could bring for lunch tomorrow. So that's not even the issue. Even though I wanted to bring some fruits. Oh, or... Maybe tomorrow evening when I'm coming from work. I have to be on that side anyways. I can just stop by the grocery store. I think I'm going to do that. Remind me tomorrow at 3.30pm to go to the grocery store. I think that's what I'll end up doing. Because honestly, I mean I might change my mind a little bit from this. And like actually go to the store. I don't know. But I just feel like all these goddamn fees on Instacart. If it was raining and all that, like I really would not have cared. I would have just been like, whatever man. You know, but... Oh, I was gonna get cherries and Old Bay. Crap. And then, too, there are a few items on here that they're having, like, a special for this week. Like, the bread that I'd normally buy, instead of paying $14.07, I'm gonna end up paying $8.97, which I might go out the block. And it's the full $14.07 for the three, if not more. And I normally buy Arizona, and it's normally $3.49, and it's a whole dollar off. Maybe I should just buy it. And I have like sardines on here and the sardines, the six that I have in the cart would normally be eleven thirty four, and it's nine right now. So it's a lot of things in here that I'm currently saving on because they're having a deal, which is why I like doing this too. Okay, when I think about it and like I'm adding it up, this is already over ten dollars that I'm saving. But see, I'm saving ten dollars and I'm spending it back. But I don't think I've ever been to the actual grocery store and there are any saving. I don't know. I don't know. I feel like I'm kind of conflicted. I like going and like tipping the guy too because he's really, really nice. I don't know. I'll wait an hour. And if I feel like getting up and walking out there, then I'll do that. And if I still feel like I need to order it, then I'll order it. And if not, I'll wait until tomorrow and stop by when I'm coming home from work. Because I really should have just gone today when I was on the road. I, I don't think I was even thinking about that because I was thinking I'd just go on Saturday since I'm going to be off anyways. But, oh... Who knows? We'll see in an hour. Because at least that will still be enough time for them to be able to deliver it before it's too late. And if not, then I'll just walk out the block, honestly. And pick the goddamn fruits myself. And that's the thing, too. Sometimes I feel like, okay, I don't care. I need it to be convenient right now. And if I could pay somebody else to do it, then that's fine. And then other times I'm just like, I want to pick my food myself. Today I don't know what mood I'm in, so now we're here. I have some... um mac and cheese on the stove that I made last night. I think I'm gonna eat that right now because I'm a little bit hungry. This morning I had porridge, but that was from like um, 8 o'clock. Because I woke up at 8 o'clock this morning because my appointment was at 10. So I feel like I'm gonna eat the mac and cheese right now. I know I'm gonna be starving later. And then that's the thing too. When I get the fruits, I could like, um, I'll have that. 
think I might end up biting the bullet and just buying buying the stuff on Instacart here, honestly. I just paid $157 to on my credit card bill. Cheating, you're paying for convenience. You don't have to walk out the block in the hot sun and sweat. You know you don't like sweating. Somebody else is gonna gracefully sit in the store and pick the items out. It's the least you can do to make sure that somebody else is paid. Okay, great, I'm convinced. I'm buying it on Instagram. You see, guys, this is exactly how it goes with me. I sit and I deliberate and I make a decision with sound mind. And I feel like that's one of the smallest ways I can help somebody to make sure that somebody else has food or somebody else is providing for their family or whatever the case is, you know, because let's face it, 2020 has really just been a rough year, you know, and it's probably going to take people a while to like get back on their feet and all that. So I think I'm going to go ahead and order it on Instacart because of all the reasons I just stated. So yeah, I'm gonna chill right now, order it, wait for it to come, and watch some TV. Because we're paying for convenience and making sure that somebody else is happy too.